Hey y'all, Irix guy here, and I wanted to explain how to make snow, uh, generate snow that you can use in your Final Cut Pro 10 projects. If you look at my uh, Santa Claus Merry Christmas video, you'll see the snow. Now there is some real snow in the background, but I also embedded some snow that I generated within Motion. So the first thing you'll need to do is purchase Apple Motion. You can get it from the Apple App Store. Uh, launch Apple Motion. Once you go into it, you're going to select Motion Project, but first I would check your settings. Typically, I use Broadcast 1080 at 59.94 frames per second in TSC. But you can use whatever settings. So double click on Motion Project, and then once you do that, what you'll do next is go into uh, go into Library within motion and then you'll see this part that says particle emitters you can actually just do a search if you want to you can browse through them all but I'll just type in snow and there's several different options the one that I used in the uh, Santa Claus video is this one which was snow blizzard you can see a little preview in the top left there but there's also snow flurry if you don't want it to be coming down as hard. So let's do snow flurry for this example. So all you do is grab this particle emitter, put it over here in your project timeline, and then see so you can hit play and you'll see the snow. And it, I mean, it seems really simple. You can, uh, you can expand this, play around with it, whatever you want to do, but for the most part, for someone that's not a, uh, a motion expert really all you have to do is is then go to file and say publish template and I could just call this snow flurry I'll call it Irix guy snow flurry and in the category I'm going to select Irix guy and then you got to select publish as final cut generator so those options are there. Hit publish. And then what you can do in your Final Cut Pro, you can go to um, you can go to it's pretty simple. So you'll see and I don't have Final Cut on this computer on this monitor rather. But the box within Final Cut that says show or hide the generators browser. You'll go there and then you'll select the place where you place this and in my case it was Irix guy and then you'll see an effect that says whatever you named it. In my case I named it Irix guy snow flurry. So what you can then do is just drag that on top of any of your projects or put it in the background however you want to layer it and that's how to make snow for your Final Cut Pro 10 productions. Hope this video is a value uh, share this video with others. Subscribe. YouTube.com forward slash Irix guy. Y'all have a good day.